Hi everyone, it's Taff. Welcome to Street Cleaning Simulator 2011. We're back, we're back on the mean streets, as this is proving to be very popular against all rhyme, reason and logic. But um, hey, I'm enjoying it and you seem to be enjoying it too, which is... All I can say is, you must be mad. But you're mad... Well, you're as mad as I am really, so that that's fine. We're obviously a happy combination together. Right, we're back. We're back in the office. Shop. So we've got... I'm just looking at the um, the upgrades we can get. I, they don't look that exciting, if I'm honest. But we got repair options. So there's obviously the brushes will start to wear. This is this is another mechanic I wasn't aware of. They've actually got maintenance. So 61 euros and 11 cents to repair the brushes. I don't I don't think they're they're that worn at the moment for 61 quid. So we we'll, we we'll, we'll hold off that. We'll um, keep the money. Uh, but yeah, that's quite interesting. So we've done two jobs, which netted us uh, eighteen thousand. Sorry, eighteen thousand. That'd be nice. Eighteen hundred and ninety-six euros and twenty-six cents. Uh, expenditure so far has just been uh, waste disposal, uh, which is two hundred and fifty euros. Great. Okay. Um, I thought I filled up with fuel and water at the end of last run, but maybe not. Maybe not. Who knows? Anyway, uh, no more invoices. Email, dear ladies and gentlemen. The town council has commissioned us to mow the grass on the side of the roads in the rural areas. Furthermore, the town council would like to cut the grass, um, sorry, would like the gra cut grass to be removed from the road surface. Because we are not equipped to do this, we would like to discuss the problem with you. Okay, discuss away. Uh, this is a cleaning job on the rural road. We will pay five big ones, five thousand euros for a thorough cleaning. Wow, that we're in the big time now. We would like you to take on the job. I would be delighted to take on the job. Best regards, Sauberhausen Park. Except that, oh yeah, continue. Right, let's go and get the uh, the beast. Right, so for five thousand, I'm expecting it's going to be quite a big job. Let's have a quick look at the map. Okay, so this is the bit of rural road we'll have to clean. Fine, great. Let's go and get the uh, go and get the orange beast. Oh, how do I get in again? C, there we go. Yes, so, um... E to start her up. In gear. Handbrake off. No. Arrow keys. So it's A... It's W-A-S-D to, to, to walk, but it's arrow keys to drive. Right, let's have a look. We've got 72 litres of water. 60 litres of thing and we've got uh, our fuel and we've got some rubbish so I'm going to empty the truck before we even go let's get prepared for this one because we weren't prepared last time were we yes we'll do this properly ah oh, crap <laughs> yeah I didn't want ah uh, I might be stuck oh there we go no, I was in neutral rather than reverse that's fine don't worry Panic not. Uh, we may need to do some repair after this because I've, I've probably cracked all that windscreen. The mirror would have gone, definitely. Okay, I'll we'll dump this crap here. Now, I seem to remember... Oh, no, it wasn't that one. How do I get into my... Um, Colored mark on the map? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's my info? Where was my info? Can you remember? There must be a way. How did I bring up my... Oh, God. It's, been, it's only been a week since I played this, and I can't remember how to... Oh. Control gives me a nice... Um, oh, does that... Ah. Is this how... Perchance, from the makers of Underground Simulator? Because if I do right control, I look down the right-hand side of the vehicle. If I press left control, I look back down the left-hand side of the vehicle. Very similar to... Um, Underground Simulator. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. They're probably the same makers then, are they? Um, I think Aerosoft are, are somewhere along the lines involved. So, it probably is, to be honest with you. Let's get some fuel as well. Now, I seem to remember this was a dry cleaning procedure, as they like to say. Um, so, oh, we better switch the engine off. We're going to get some fuel. There's a tip for you. Never... Never, never leave your engine on when you're putting fuel in. It's it. People get worried and get nervous at the uh, at the petrol station. 
So let's just fill her up. 150 a litre. It's probably what it is actually in the UK. Because obviously Euros would be a bit. It's about 140 something in the UK. Is this diesel? I'm guessing, yeah, it's black, it's diesel. Okay. Oh no, sorry. Let's get back in the truck. Start her up. Oh, I keep. Ah, get off the WASD keys. Right, so we've got fuel, we've got an empty truck, we don't need the water, so let's, let's go. Have we got the. Uh, Oh. oh god, what have I done? I'm hitting buttons because I'm trying to remember what the uh, L's lights. Oh wow, okay, backspace is um, reset back to um, back to base. Well that's good to know. I'm glad I didn't do that when I was out of the yard because that would have been really frustrating. But okay, let's stop, stop um, larking around and let's head out to the uh, to the job. It's a lovely day. What's the time? It is uh, two. Well, it's twenty-five to three in the afternoon, uh, which is lovely. So we're gonna we're probably gonna be blocking up the uh, the school rush. You know, you get you get this almost around three o'clock. All the uh, all the parents start making their way to go and get the pick, pick the kids up, and the roads are normally a nightmare. Whoa, what is wrong with my driving today? I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll get there, don't worry. Uh, so where do we need to go? I reckon, is it straight up? Straight, oh, it's straight. All the way. Can't go wrong. Lights have gone red. Do you reckon they'll be green by the time we'll cycle through to green? No. You always get that, don't you? You have a crossing there and somebody shortcuts it because they can't be bothered to walk the uh, the last 20 centimetres to the actual uh, to the actual uh, crossing. Yeah, the, the the lights in this game seem to be really high, don't they? Look, even the pedestrian lights seem to be a good six feet above. Well, that, that the whole thing needs to be dropped by about six foot, doesn't it? Because look, look at the, the, the actual pedestrian lights, which are there to say go, are about um, oh, it's probably a good half a meter above the uh, the head of any p pedestrian. It seems a bit crazy, but I'm just being picky. Just being picky. Right. Has this got another gear? No, we just got drive. So uh, we're gonna cruise through town. Have the radio on if we had. Window down. Arm out, get the nice trucker's tan on one arm, that'd be good, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's a bit hazy this, this afternoon, isn't it? People milling around, going about their business. Can we get the lights? Can we get the lights? Come on, I'm I'm flat. Flat no we're not gonna we're gonna we're gonna miss the lights all the way down here. And the brakes aren't too hot either. Whoa! Sorry love. Wow. Yeah, that did, we did overshoot a little bit. So not only is it slow, it's also very slow to stop as well, which is a bit weird. That's horn. <laughs> F is... Ah. Side light. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, crap. I've just set that going. Oh, we can still move. That's fine. Don't worry. We're not going to miss the lights because because uh, of that. Tea's water, of course. It's a bit random. Okay, we're away. Great. I do like this game. It you can tell actually that it's. It's made by, um, probably made by the, uh, the same guys who brought us the World of Underground 3, I think it is, the uh, London Underground, because it is actually, textures are nice, 
it is for a simulator. It's not bad. It's not. It's not a grade A simulator like Euro Truck 2 or Farming Sim 2013. But it's not bad. It's not bad. You know, it's better than the usual muck that gets churned out, as I said. And I can and learn figuring this out. You know that 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 kind of does ring true that it is the same guys because. Uh, it does have that feel of better than standard quality. I wouldn't say it's it's the top end, but it's better than standard. Better than what, better than what you used to get with these simulator games. I can hear a noise. I know it's the engine. Oh, it might be in the car in front actually, because it's, it's gone away now. So, oh, he bounced the curb. Then did you see that? Not good. Not good. Right, I can see the countryside ahead, the lovely rolling hill, by the looks of it. Um, have I got much of a... I don't seem to have anyone behind me. Just give it a wiggle so I can see, just in case I've got any blind spots. Oh, there we go, look, that's the garage garage, just in case you want to know where the uh, the garage is. So good, they named it twice. Oh, okay, so here we go. So. They've cut the grass verge, and that's why the grass is there. Well, that looks like a blooming... You'll have to wait, mate. You, you look comfy. Hang on. I've got to remember how to do... Mirror, mirror adjustment? Are you kidding me? We can adjust our mirrors? How do we do this? Is it... No. No. <laughs> This is awesome. How do I adjust my mirrors, though? I, I don't know how to adjust them. Um, no, we're, we're not going to worry about that. Okay. Let's get that off. Right. Let's go and get the... We want that. Uh, no, we want this one out, don't we? So we'll extend it. Drop it down. <laughs> Look at these people. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Whoa, look! Look at the second guy! That is our twin! That is our twin! Look at us, and look at the second guy! We've got a doppelganger! Unbelievable! Oh, whoops, hang on. Okay, sorry guys. I was... I'm, I'm just faffing about. Oh, look! That's how you do it! Oh my god, we can adjust our mirrors! How... Fantastically German is that? Okay, let's... Um. Oh no, we don't want water, we don't want water. Let's just set it going. And we're going. Sorry, guys. Sorry. 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 Right. Something that was missing from last time, and uh, I, I do apologise. I know it was a, it was a firm favourite. Boom! Action cam. We're back. Oh wow! Look at all this grass. Oh, you can see they have cut the verge there. So obviously. It was a little bit um, gnarly old roots and old bushes and sort of old brambles which you know they you always find them at the sides of roads where they're not really maintained because they're those kind of quick growing hardy type plants which just grow anywhere so yes doing a great job let's see what other action cams we have that's all we got on that action cam oh nothing on that action cam okay Let's, um, we've got no traffic behind us, which is great. Or I think that, that pickup's got a nice V6 engine in it, because I could hear that purring. Lovely. And we are doing a fantastic job of this. Right, let's, let's, let's while we're in there, let's fiddle with the mirrors. Because, like, look, I noticed you can select the mirror. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. We can do the mirrors. This is, this is why I love simulation games. Oh, yes. Oh yes. Uh, let's bring that one in a bit. Oh, see, I mean, seriously, how how cool is this? You're probably thinking, not really, but I think this is brilliant. This is this is. I'm probably not adjusting these mirrors correctly, but I don't care. I'm just, I just absolutely thrilled. Oh, that top one's not right, is it? Let's 
So what, what one is this? Is this for looking at the roads? Oh yeah, I guess that's for looking at the roads, isn't it? And looking down. So we got a car behind us. Brilliant. Oh, I that is that is fantastic. Oh, we're going to celebrate with a bit more action cam. So we can adjust our mirrors. Amazing. You can't even do that on Euro Truck. I take it back. This is a triple A title all the way. Oh, wow. You're probably going... Shut up. <laughs> fair, fair, fair comment. But I, I, I really do love when it's that detailed. We've got a bit of a queue behind us, but they can wait. You know, they'll just get narky. Oh, look, we're coming up to the town, town border by the looks of it. Salberhausen. Kres Reinstad, okay, or Kree Reinstad, I don't know, don't know how you pronounce that first word, or the second word to that matter, well look, this is this is quite pretty, how far have we got to go, oh wow, we got a long way to go, I might actually get the other brush going, I can remember how to do this. Oops, wrong one. Um, so how do I, how do I, how do I move it along? Can you remember? Ah, there we go. Is that is that working? Is that working? We got two brushes on the go now. Yes. I don't know if that's making a huge difference, but it, it feels like it is in my head. So um, ah, out in the countryside. Oh, look at the traffic in the mirrors. Maybe that's why we adjusted them so we couldn't see all the traffic in the mirrors. Come on, let, let's just let's be nice. Let's pull off. What are you waiting for? No, no, you don't follow me off. What are you doing? I got off the road so you could use it, and they're all following me around the corner, right? Fine. You can wait then. You can sit and wait and we'll watch. Oh. You see, you should have gone. Shouldn't, should have gone, shouldn't you? Right. Okay, great. Well, look, they're going to be a bit like that, so um, we're just going to cruise along and do what. We're going to mind our own business. Uh, we got, we have got quite a bit of trip. Oh, it's not too bad. Unfortunately, there doesn't seem to be any uh, fines or any penalties for blocking the, the entire traffic. Why is that flashing? Oh, it's my beacon. What an idiot. Right, let's go off into this lay-by to allow them to go by. There we go. There you go. I, I, at the end of the day, I am a responsible professional road cleaning um, attendant, or whatever the official term is. Come on. Come on, mate. Come Come by, come by. Sounds like a sheepdog. Come by, come by. That's what they say in sheepdog trials in the UK. I don't know if they do that around the world. Um, but yeah, they do. Which is great. Okay, back on the road. We're coming to the end of this one strike. And we've only got 27% full. So that's good. Uh, so we should be able to do this in one queen clean sweep. <laughs> clean sweep. What a great pun. Not funny, but it was a great pun. <laughs> oh, man. So it does actually look like it's starting to grey over, so we might get a bit of rain. Which, um, I don't know how that affects the old dry cleaning solution. That will probably be tamper. It will probably um, get loads of crap. But the roads do seem to be clear, and it's not a bad day to be uh, out on the roads cleaning as we go. Another V6 purring by. 
another V6 per and by. Sound like a bubble gum ban. Oh, careful sign. Like a pro. I think. I thought there was a siren, but I think it's actually some bird song. Well, uh, we'll get to the end of this, and we'll um. Oh, I missed a bit. I missed a bit before I know, but um. Now the pressure's off. It doesn't really matter. Right, a bit of action cam. Double action cam. Oh yeah, it's definitely bird song. Which is nice. Nothing that Nothing quite as nice nothing quite as nice. Nothing quite as good as uh, bird song when you sit in the garden nice and peace and quiet and then you get the, the, the gentle drone of a, a, a cleaning truck rumble by. Oh it looks like we've got some wheat at the end of here. Or something. Or long grass anyway. Right. Jobs are good and switch that off and lift it up. There we go. One side done. Fantastic. Should we um I need to adjust those mirrors. Let's just Oh hang on. Oh no, I tell you what. Let's just there's a there's a pull over here. Let's just um turning here. Crap! I'm not driving very well today. Thanks for your patience. Okay, let's have a quick look and get out. Oh, it's WADS keys now, isn't it? So here we are, we're back in the rural rural world, which is quite good. Um, Bubblegum. It's bubblegum, isn't it? Bubble -la 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 -la. Anyway, Landwirt, Shines, Lutcher, so that's Farmer, something. Something about farming. My German's not very good, but that's definitely something about farming. I'm pretty sure of that. So, here we go. Beautiful, beautiful Sauberhausen countryside. Listen to that bird song. Look, look at the gravel down there. Lovely. It's not as scenic as I thought it was going to be when I uh, stopped the truck. Uh, so we'll, we'll get back on with it. I thought there's going to be something nice to look at, but maybe if we just go down here and have a look around through the fence. No, not really. Okay. Sorry about that. That was a bit of a waste. I thought I was going to give you a nice little sightseeing tour as well. We thought we might as well enjoy it as we're out here. You know, we get lunch break, so we might as well um, we might as well use the time. Ah, oh, goodness! I've hit literally every obstacle in my way today. It's not been the best um, driving. It's a Sunday morning, and it hasn't been the best. There we go, great. And we want to do this, oh, this one. Great. I wonder if they'll start showing wear indicators, because that's what I really need, to, to, to know when um, I need to repair them and replace them. You see, it, there's all these things you've got to worry about, this management side of uh, street cleaning, which is, um, you don't know the pressure. You don't know the <laughs> Oh, man. You know, any any entrepreneur or any um Whoa, we're going too fast. I'll leave that bit, I can't be bothered to go back. Uh, any entrepreneur or any um independent uh, little business or any, you know, self self employed person will know Oh my goodness, I'm missing so much. I think we must we're going downhill, that's why we're accelerating so quickly. Fine, okay. I've got to bear that in mind. This is like this is like pro pharma. So you've got to take the combine slow when you when you look. I'm actually just freewheeling now. I'm not accelerating or anything. I'm just going to dab the brake every now and again. So, which is good, which is good because that shows that this mechanic, there is a mechanic. Please don't hit anything behind us. Of weight and physics. 
it's literally been, I'm not touching the controls now, and it's being dragged and we're accelerating down the hill, which shows, I'm just going to down the brake, uh, which shows that, I'll tell you what, I'll put it in neutral, can I put it in neutral? No, it won't let me put it in neutral, well, what if I put it in neutral, there we go, and we just start rolling down the hill, so that's good, most games don't have that, they don't have that kind of physics. So this game has, it just, it's the game that just keeps giving. It's got real proper physics. It's got adjustable mirrors. I mean, I can't remember the last game where you could adjust your mirrors. You're probably going to go every driving game worth its salt, you can adjust the mirrors. Well, I can't remember one. I'm, I know there must have been some. I know some, like, I think the Simbin ones, you could adjust your angle of where you sit, and obviously that would affect the mirrors and stuff as well, but, you know, you can't, unless I'm mistaken, you can't do that in Euro Truck. And we've got quite a bit of um, speed going down this hill now. And we're still in neutral, we're still in neutral. I haven't put it in gear yet. I love, oh, oh, brilliant. Brilliant. The game that just keeps on giving. I I take it all back. This is probably now becoming my third favourite simulator after... Oh, I don't know, actually. That's probably... It's in my top five. Oh, can I go that far? Can I... <laughs> so, obviously, you've got Euro Truck is probably number one. Farming Sim is right up there. Um, you got Train Simulator, which I love. You've also got underground simulator which is really tidy little simulation uh, I'm talking mechanics wise not necessarily my favorite overall game and I think this has got to be in there as well because when it comes to favorites I'd have to put in agricultural simulator which is beyond doubt a flawed piece of crap but it's got something about it which I love um, but this again I am so glad I decided to take the, the mickey out of this game and pick it up and play it because it is actually very good for what it is, you know. If you've got a passion for street cleaning, I think I could definitely recommend this to you. If you're not if you don't have a passion for street cleaning or any mundane tasks, I would probably look somewhere else. But for now, I'm enjoying this and and the views suggest you're enjoying this as well. You crazy people. But hey, where else can you get adjustable mirrors and actual physics? Hey, hey, hey! I know. Um, clean that bit up. We might. We're still not in gear. We're still. We're, just, we're still using our momentum from coming down the hill. That's how good that was. How are we doing traffic-wise? We got a little bit of a tailback. It's fair to say. There is a slight tailback. And we are starting to lose a bit of momentum. But we're doing okay. I reckon I reckon if I don't touch it we can make it to the lights without touching it again. Do you reckon? We're doing oh well, I'll, I'll have to steer a little bit because we are drifting away from the edge, but we're doing okay, we've got 80 litres of fuel still, still, and um, we've got 67 um, full of capacity, so um, we've still got plenty of room to just finish this last bit. So I reckon the next two trucks are probably bigger capacity for storage, because obviously they're going to have cleaning devices on them, same as this one. Um, but I'm just going to re reckon like the fuel, the water tanks are bigger and the actual waste capacity is bigger as well. Which will probably you'll probably use them for doing the big long distance ones as well because I think the other trucks are probably going to be a little bit quicker. This one's li literally a, a town centre nipper, isn't it? That's what it is. Just to bounce around. Look, just go now. Don't wait for me to get there. Just go. If you're going to cross the road, go. Oh, go on, go on. There we go. We've made it. We've made it on purely our momentum. Right, let's break there. That was brilliant. Go on, you go by. Uh, 
Excellent, right? How are we looking? Um, what's the lights? The lights, the lights are red. Great. That's a, that is a job well done. The streets look fantastic. I can't see the lights. Go. We're away. Oh, I'm going in drive. Go. <laughs> it's still in neutral. Oh dear. Sorry, everyone. So this is Sauberhausen. Wait, wait, merged man. Some glitched into each other. That's a pretty little town, is Sauberhausen. Obviously, it's got some. Um, it's obviously got an old part. So you've got some old buildings, and then you've got some like 60s, 70s. Got awful. There's the garage, garage again. Um, Der Leiden. Der Leiden. Brakes, brakes! Oh, good gosh. Yeah. Oh, go on. Go on, we haven't got all day. <laughs> Not that I can keep up with him. Trundle, trundle, trundle. Look, he was indicating there and he didn't turn. Why didn't you turn? I think he's lost. He's probably looking at a map, that's why he was delayed. Oh, look at this. Is that graffiti? Oh, no, there's a man standing on top of a truck. Oh, break. We're going to miss every light. You know, we've, it's one of those things, isn't it? If you if you miss the lights once and they're in a string, you miss every single one of them. But if you catch it right, you're straight through every one. You get the timing just so. Well, there's a woman's face with that and a purple thing next, uh, stuck onto her side of her face. I don't know what that's about. Uh, hair. Oh, it's a hair. <laughs> hair. It's either um, a shop that's just Mister, or it's because um, we are in Germany, um, or it's um, a hairdresser's or a hair saloon or something like that. Hi, Dave. Oh no 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 no! I hit the wrong key. No 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 no! Don't don't! Oh God! Let's not mucky up the road. Let's not muck up the road. Oh, thank God it didn't open. Ah, oh. I was just going to bip to my mate, or our doppelganger, who was walking down the road, our twin, and uh, I thought, oh no, I hit G and H too close together. I might have to rebind those. But of course, the good thing about having a council vehicle with the orange light on the top, it means you can literally drive anywhere. Anyone who's ever done any work for the council, I did. I, I spent a, a summer between leaving... What was it leaving sixth form, which is when I just completed my A levels? So I was what about 18? That summer I worked for a, the count, well, a contractor for the council doing street lights. So I had a big old cherry picker lorry, used to go up there, change the bulb, change the eye on there, change the, um, the, the little um, the sensor box in there, give it a clean, give it a paint, and away you go. That's what I did for the summer to make some money before I went to college. That uh, is alright, that's a good job, good laugh. Um, got my own van. Oh, completely oblivious. Completely oblivious. Um, so yeah, uh, uh, and that's one of the great things. Wherever you want it, wherever you want it to go, pedestrian lines bit, stick the yellow lights on, hazard lights on, and away you went down there at slow speed. We used to just go down the parks and have lunch in the parks, it was great. Probably highly illegal, but um, yeah, that's what we did. I was an impressionable, impressionable youth back then, so um, I, I would always point the finger to the uh, to the to my mate to say, "Look, that was his, he, he led me astray." That's how it works. Ah, I, I reckon then if I can, can I just that? I can adjust that one as well. Sweet. I'm not really sure what that's looking at. Oh, there we go. Look at the brush. Brilliant. We need, we need to be looking forward. Uh, let's just empty the rubbish into the um, the rubbish place. Yeah, that's enough for the mirror adjustment. Oh, we've already got a bit of crap sitting down there. Right. G this time. 74. Almost. 
almost three quarters full. And amazingly, the grass has gone. Oh no, that's quite cool. Look, I don't know if I'm just imagining this now. But the, rather than being just grey and black rubbish, can you see green in there? Which are the leaves? Obviously, technically, it should all be green because it was just leaves. But there will be other crap in there as well. Look, there's crisp packet and um, and uh, some red and white. I don't know why I'm in. Why am I inspecting refuse? For goodness' sake. How has my life plummeted to such depths that I am checking refuge? Oh, beautiful. Alright, let's just go over to the office and uh, we'll put the uh, the invoice in and get some cash. Happy days. I wouldn't mind a lick of paint around here. It's a bit, it's a bit grubby, isn't it? Okay, engine off, parking brake on, stick in neutral. Great. Okay, let's go. And, let's um, let's go and build them. Uh, where's my invoice? Invoice. So we can build them. <gasps> oh, ninety-one percent. Oh, we must have missed quite a bit actually. So that's still four and a half grand. Boom. Next job will pay two grand. This is. Bonesk again, Mr. Bonesk. We have very, uh, two very nice locations in our town that must be cleaned from time to time. I would like to ask you on behalf of the town to clean both of these locations. Also, it would be grateful if you could carry out the cleaning at night, after midnight. Okay, a wet cleaning procedure. Why does that make me giggle every time? Is required uh, and will include a nighttime surcharge. Eh? We'll pay you tw uh, two grand for the. Oh, okay, great. Um, let's have a quick look. How is the old um, the old vehicle? Is that does that need repair? 110. Yeah. Okay. Let's repair that. I have. Uh, I did crop it a few times, and um, the brushes have been used quite a bit as well. Okay. So there we are. Next time out, we're gonna have to do some nighttime cleaning. So it's probably gonna be after the the pubs kick out, after the clubs kick out. So it's probably gonna be drunks and yous and and um, all sorts of. Um, leftover takeaways and and um, what happens when drunk people eat takeaways waiting for taxis there's going to be puke everywhere uh, and that's going to be our job no doubt so there we go I'll leave it there guys I hope you have enjoyed this um, and I hope you're enjoying the series of um, <laughs> street cleaning simulator oh, why do I giggle every time I say that it's ridiculous but there we go <laughs> I'll leave it there thanks for watching and I'll see you next time